Hey, what's up guys? It's Pat and welcome back to Minecraft Epic Proportions And today we're actually gonna be leaving our house and going out and hopefully finding a boss to fight It'd be really awesome if we could fight like the Walker King or something, but still we need to find like his structure um, But anyways before we do that I had a couple things I wanted to show you guys and first I now know how to make the gilded diamond shield for whatever reason, with not enough items, the recipe just wasn't showing up, so I had no idea how to make it last episode. I kind of, like, really rely on it. But you put the diamond shield in the middle and surround it like that with gold ingots, and now I have a better diamond shield. So hopefully that'll help us a lot. And also, I did make the dishwasher. I know people have been suggesting it to, like, fix my tools. I kind of like these, but I, but I kind of don't. I mean, um, you fix everything with coal... But it takes forever. It's like 10 minutes long. So I'm not going to repair them right now because they really don't need to be repaired like too badly. Um, also, I found out that I can't put like the sword or the bow in any of these. I don't know if there's like another machine for that. And the reason I'm not repairing them quite yet is because I don't want to waste any of my enchantment levels. Um, I really need to get it to 72, I think, for the more health mod. And I'll get my last heart. And that's the reason I have not enchanted anything lately. I really want that last heart, and if we use some, then we have to get all the way back to 72 again, and that'll take a long time. Oh, one other thing. Also, I am going to make a bigger backpack. I finally got the amount of string we needed to make one. They really make it very hard to make a bigger backpack, but here we go. One big backpack, so hopefully we will never like be full on inventory again. I, I know I have a problem with my inventory where I'm always full, so now I've got three regular bags and a giant one, and it's twice the size. This is normal. This is a giant one. So yeah, I seriously have a problem. If I get everything full today, then we really got to work on, you know, not picking up every single item. Um, but anyways, I think I did everything I wanted to do. I got a bigger bag. I fixed my shield. And yeah, I got the dishwasher. I'll use it to repair stuff after. So yeah, we're going to leave. We are going to leave. Hopefully find a boss to fight. Oh, you attack everything. The iron golem attacks every single thing. The centaurs aren't even bad. They're not aggressive. Why must you do that? That's why next time we kill a mutant creeper and get like another like little creeper pet, we definitely cannot let any of these pets near them. He'll kill it too, just like Bami. And then we won't like the iron golem either, and then I'll never have a pet like to fight with me. So yeah, we can't do that. So with the simu crab people, I think I'm just gonna let them chill for a while. I mean, we only have like one credit, 1.61, so we kind of have to wait till there's more. And then we can actually, you know, start building some epic structures. Because there's some awesome stuff. And I think I'm going to save up for, like, a really cool one. Are your arms stuck in the air? What are you what are you doing? I love this house. Someone did leave a good suggestion that said I should build a bunch of these houses. Like the, you know, poor man's house. And then a bunch of people will move in. Which is probably a good idea. I may do that when we get back. But yeah, I really want to go out and fight a boss. There's been lots of, like, suggestions to fight the next boss. And I think today we are going to do that. But first, we really need to go to bed. Like, it's getting dark. I don't want to leave in the middle of the night. That's like the worst time possible to leave. All right. Is it night yet? There we go. All right. So we're ready. I think what we're going to do is take the teleporter to where like the sand dungeons and all that stuff was and head out from there. And we got four more simu credits. So we're up to five. I think if we get like 20 or something, then that'd be good. We'd get something pretty big. All right. Let's leave. Okay. So yeah, the desert had a ton of stuff, if you remember. There was, like, dungeons under the ground, like, they were massive. And also, this is where we fought the fire demon. I'd be satisfied with another legendary beast, though. So that structure over there, we have not checked out at all. Oh, let's take the ender dragon. Let's take the ender dragon. All right. It's our first time really getting to explore with our new dragon bike. I don't want that color. I like how there's, like, different colors. I get to choose. Should we go red? Yeah, let's go red. Okay, so I got a little lag there. I might get some lag. I mean, with the mods I have installed, I know a lot of people can't even run the mod pack. It's just there's so many structures. Every once in a while, I get, like, a spike while things are loading. So we're going to go over to this weird thing. I have never seen it before. I'm not sure if it's from, like, um, Dungeon Pack or from Ruins. I'm assuming Ruins. And it looks kind of like a trap, to be honest. It's made of, like, sand. It probably collapsed on me or something like that. So we'll see if we can get into here. Actually, I need some food real quick. So I'll swap this with a backpack. I don't need them all, like, in my main, like, bar. Okay. We'll have some cooked pork chops, and we'll try to get in here. I don't know what's wrong with him. He's cheering. He's in a very good mood after killing. So, yeah, how could this not be a trap? It looks like it would just crush you if you broke any sand. Is there, like, a bottom floor? Curious. Oh, there is. And what's in here? Nothing. How about down here? Nothing. Okay. Why did they do that? 
Anything behind this? No, of course not. I see how it is. I see how it is. So let's just get out of here because they're mean. I really thought there'd be a treasure or something. Okay. It's probably at the top of like this tower. So I'm assuming if I break one of these, it's all going to come crashing down because, you know, they're like, they're not supposed to be like that. So should I go? Here we go. It's coming down. It's crashing down. So yeah, I guess it would try to drown you would be my guess. I'm kind of afraid to go in, so I'm actually going to take the Ender Dragon up to the top to see if there's something up there. Alright, we'll take the black one. I like the variety. So yeah, from the looks of it, it probably would do something bad if you're in there. I just want to make sure I'm safe about it. Last thing I want is to, like, drown. Okay, so is there a place to land? I can't really see. Oh yeah, there is. Okay, so we'll get off the Ender Dragon. There's no chest up here, which is kind of depressing. So what is below us exactly? Another part that didn't break. So what if I broke that? Get me out of this. I got myself in a situation. Alright, so this wouldn't actually kill me, right? I'm just, I'm just checking. Maybe if you broke some more of this, it would fall down. I know if I broke these, I'd assume it would hurt me. What if I break this? I just want to see what happens, like, for fun. Yeah. That's something you don't want to do, probably. Probably catches you, like, right inside the place. But it doesn't look like there's anything for us, so we will just jump down and head off. So we have a couple choices. We can go towards the nether, which you can't really step on, so probably a bad choice. <laughs> Looks like there's a snow biome over there and a forest here. I'm thinking forest. Look what happened to that poor tree. That poor tree. Not much left. The damn lava. So there have been other suggestions as well to actually switch my pet to something different. So I think we'll do that. All right, fam guide. And... We're not going to use the Ender Dragon right now. We'll explore by foot. Because what I want to use is my... What is it? I'm trying to choose right now. I want to use the Ocelot. That's it. So I can run really quick. Faster sprinting. And it's free. So yeah, guys. The real reason I haven't like used any enchantment levels on anything is because I need to save them up for the health mod. And soon... I'll be up to, like, the max health. So I set it at 20. I customized it, like, specifically for the mod pack. And when we get there, I'll enchant, like, the hell out of everything. All right, there's a cave over there, but I'm not really too worried about that. I want to fight a boss. That's what I want. All right, is that a, um, a giant gravestone? A really big one? Those are always cool. I think I need, um, you know, Silk Touch to pick that up. And it really glitched weird, didn't it? Let me see here. I don't think I could pick this up without Silk Touch. Which is, that's the kind of, like, stuff I'm going to be getting when I actually have the enchantment levels I can spare. But right now, I just can't spare them. Alright, let's get through here. I'll just use this. Whatever. Let me get through. If we open up our map here, anything in the distance? A couple battle towers. Looks like maybe even a giant tree. Oh, hello! It's a, it's a dryad. There's some cool stuff around. Some interesting mobs. I don't want to kill her. She seems nice. I won't hurt you. There's a couple around. A bunch of pigs, too. I'm feeling friendly today. I'm surprised the iron... Oh, I don't have the iron home. If he was here, they would be dead. So, yeah, I see a battle tower. I'm not going to go into one because we already fought one, but I'm sure we'll fight others in the series. But what is this? Right here. I see something. Is it like an upside-down battle tower? Because they can go down and they can go up, and it's kind of hard to tell from here. Ooh, a big tree. Yeah, I think it's one of the ones that go down. Yes, that answers my question. <laughs> All right, so in here, there's a trap. Everything is a trap with these mods. So, ooh. Ooh, I haven't seen any of these. So this right here is some gravestones. And if I break this, there should be, like, wood stuff under. Not that I really need wood stuff. So, yeah. <laughs> if I really want a wood sword and stuff, I, I could get it. But I, I, don't, I don't really want that. But I'm pretty sure I can chop this whole thing down for fun. It'll be fun to see. Let's try. It's not taking that long to break either. Bam! How awesome is that? So now it's pretty obvious I can see the trap. The pig's looking at me. He's like, what have you done to my home? I'm, I'm sorry. I didn't know that you lived there. It's, it's a bad place. There's lava. I feel bad now. But um, we're going to go up here. I'm going to plug up this lava and we'll check out the chest. All right. So what should I use? I have a couple like weird things on me. I will use this. Okay. So yeah, everything from I feel like it's ruins is a freaking trap. So what happens is you break this and, you know, the lava pours on you and you try to get the chest. And we don't want that. I don't think I have a shovel, but it, but it's okay. It's fine. I'll just break all this with my block. Pig's still staring at me. He's like, that was my ladder. I, I'm sorry. 
I'm sorry. Relax. It's okay. All right, we got flint and steel. Maybe I could use that. Don't really need a ball right now. Okay, so let's see here. I'm trying to figure out where we're going. We'll go in this direction. And hopefully find something. Oh, what are those? What are those? Garden gnomes. There's so many cool things around. What do you guys drop? I feel bad killing them. All right. What was that, clay? Yeah, he dropped some clay and he dropped a cherry? Did he drop? No, he dropped the brick. My bad. All right, so we are going to head in this direction. Oh, hello. Poisonous life seal sprint and one up. 160 hit points. It's like a boss fight right here. Sorry. Oh, okay, if I hit one, you're all aggressive. Die. Oh, God. Don't hurt me. I hate being poisoned so much. Almost got her. One up. She healed herself. Finish her. All right, anything good? And I, oh, well, I didn't have a shovel, I guess, on me. I probably had one at home. Let's see. So I got an efficiency two shovel. We'll just hold on to that for our adventure. So this is where I need to put stuff in my big backpack. At least we'll have plenty of wood. This is actually good because we could bring it back home for the Simicraft people because they always like, give, give me some wood. And I'm like, I don't, I don't have any. Now I have a ton. Okay, so I put all that stuff in there. I think we're pretty good. Yeah, we have plenty of room. This should work out good. What are you? There's so many animals around. Okay, you were just brown a second ago. Very dark. Weird. That was weird. I've never seen a pig do that before. Okay, so everything I see on the minimap kind of looks like it's a battle tower. Or, like, one of these partial battle towers. Did I just see the, another lightning spirit? I'm pretty sure I did. Right there, lightning spirit. Damn, I don't want to fight one I've already fought. I'm looking for new bosses, new fights, not the same ones. All right, at least we sprint like crazy around here. So I see a desert. That could be a good spot. I'm trying to find something. Alligators around. Okay, at least we could run. We could really run through a desert quickly and possibly find something awesome. Ooh, a giant pyramid. Ooh, I'm excited now. I'm not sure if this one's from Legendary Beasts. I know there's a couple pyramid mods. Like, not pyramid mods, but mods that have pyramids in them. I think this one's bigger than the one from Legendary Beasts, if I'm not mistaken here. Let's climb up this beast of a of a tower. Why are there why are there leather boots there? It's weird. Wow, this is amazingly huge. Okay, so yeah, this is not Oh, I know which one this is. I really need to eat though. Yeah, lots of rewards for us here. That's awesome. And another one of those weird towers. I don't I don't like those. Okay, so we're gonna eat really quickly here. And then we have a lot of iron. I think there's a spawner underneath this, to be honest. And yeah, a lot of stuff is loading in right now. Okay, so I'm not 100% sure. Please don't be lava underneath. Okay, just a spawner, skeleton spawner. Nice. Awesome, we're getting so much iron. We're never going to need iron again with this many blocks. All right, that's a pretty good find. Okay, I'll grab all these. Mountain looks weird until it loads. Please load. So under this, I'm pretty sure there's nothing in the pyramid at all. We can definitely double check, though. I think it's... Because I remember reviewing this mod a while ago. And, um... I checked in creative, and I didn't find anything. So yeah, I, I don't think so, unless they added something. It's just a really cool pyramid is what it is, with a lot of iron for a reward. Oh god, I don't want to fight the harpies right now. Run. Run, pet. Oh god. They're not letting me run. They keep hitting me. Oh my god, I, ca I can't run. Oh my god, they have slowness on me. That's what it is. Okay, please keep moving. <laughs> this is not good. Okay, I'm just going to have to fight. All right, fine. Damn chickens. All right, time for you to die. That's what happens when they mess with me. They're going to die. It's going to happen. All right. I lost a lot of health. So, yeah, they hit pretty hard. What is this structure? It's getting dark. I'm trying to figure out what this is here. So, I haven't found a boss yet, but we are searching. Okay, so in here, could there possibly be anything? I'm just checking. You know, you never know. I, I always wonder, like... Why they make them like this if they're not going to put a chest in it? Doesn't look good unless they put it under the sand. That'd be tricky. No. <laughs> I was hoping. Alright, so we'll continue in the desert, I guess. And there's a lot of battle towers around. The thing about the battle towers is the boss actually has a random amount of health. So there might even be harder ones than the one we fought originally. Alright, so we'll just head over this way. Oh, look. A bunch of snow golems. Fighting. What are they fighting? Ice pigmen. Interesting. So some crazy fights going on over here. And I think I'm going to head... I don't know where I'm going. 
I actually see a dynamic maze. That might be cool. Oh, so many choices here. It's kind of small. I think we'll wait for a bigger maze. Because, oh, is that a, a light tower? Lighthouse over there? So, yeah, some cool stuff around here. And I also see this obsidian tower. Oh, God. <laughs> That's not where I meant to go. Get me out of here. They're all staring at me. I'm sorry. Do you live here? D is this... Okay, I'll leave. I'll leave. They're all looking at me weird. I will go this way. So, I think there's some chests in there. And... Whoa! Look at that. Look at that in the distance. Gotta check that out. Definitely. Sorry, guys. My game actually crashed. So, now I'm actually down inside it. So, um, what I did is I went on my Ender Dragon. I switched to Reyna. And I just jumped down. So, yeah, there's a chest right here. And in here, we've got Shining Baubles. I don't know if I say that right or not. Cocoa beans, and um, we got enchanted books, but I'm not gonna grab any because I could just choose them with you know the enchanting mod I have. Silk touch and sharpness four. But anyways, we are we are way down here. I think I could just fly out though. All right, so Ender Dragon, get me out of here, please. I don't like this spot. I'll go with the green one. All right, and yeah, there are spawners. They don't actually spawn them down on you though, because I think I'm too far away. All right, let's get out of here. I'm poisoned from the poison spider. And what else did I want to check out? This weird structure. Yes. Is that a villager? Like, it kind of looks like a villager, right? Alright, so I am going to... Nope. Stop on the other side. I don't want to have to swim there. Alright, so we'll get off the Ender Dragon and see what this is exactly. It's got to have something in it. I feel like this is going to be valuable. Um, how should we do this? Should I just mine into it and, and hope there's something inside? Alright, I feel bad breaking it now. Now that I'm seeing nothing, I'm going to feel horrible. Um, it's a cool looking structure and there'll be nothing inside. I'll be a little upset. Alright, even a trap? Come on, give me something here. I'd be happy with the trap right now. It's it's not looking so good, I don't think. Maybe we should actually... Let me take the dragon fly to the top of it and do it from there. Alright, let's try this again. It's kind of a big structure. So I'm going to get off right here. Oh, by the way, guys, I should do the fanchion right now while I'm kind of just, like, digging through. So today's winners were Camron, Pokemon Snorlax, and Dark Anime 13. So congrats to you guys. And if you are new to the series, all you have to do is leave a comment in the video, and I'm going to randomly pick three people each time to put into a building we call the fanchion. So, yeah, I think I just wrecked this structure, that, and it has absolutely nothing in it. Oh, well. I tried. You always have to check. That's the thing. You're like, I don't know. How the hell would I know? If there was something here. <laughs> Apparently, it was just a cool looking structure. Where's its eyes? Let me find those again. Just kind of curious if there's anything behind them. Where are your eyes? I cannot tell what anything is from here. Like, at all. Oh, God, I fell right off it. I'm alright, we've got Reyna. Okay, so like, right there. I don't think, um... Let me just go up to him. What if there's something right behind those? Luckily, we can jump. But yeah, clearly I've ruined the structure. I probably wouldn't be able to rebuild it if I wanted to. I'm not I'm not that good. Okay, let me get up here. And yeah, it's it's just an eye, okay? It's just an eye. <laughs> Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to leave a like and to subscribe. Thanks for watching. I will see you next time.